and it's that time of the week when Paul Merson joins us for his Super 6 predictions. Hello again, Super 6 is back this week. Yet another winner. My money down the pan. This is the day before Soccer Saturday. We are 24 hours exactly before we go on the air. I've just finished with Merce. Did my Super 6 predictions before he got upstairs. Oh, I didn't want him to copy them, <laughs> that is for sure. Uh, and we've had a bit of a chat about the weekend's football and so on and so forth. Now, Merce is going to go and put his feet up for the rest of the day now. Practice his pronunciations. Uh, we've got a production meeting coming up which will iron out the running order and what, you know, what pattern discussions might take. They usually don't, Merce will vouch for this. We start off thinking it's going to go one way and it goes completely the other way. The one thing you can guarantee, though, is especially after the week that Liverpool have had, we will be taking the mickey out of Phil Thompson. That is guaranteed. So we'll go through that. I'll go through the stats for all of the divisions. Some of my paperwork now, I've done a lot of it already at home during the course of the week. Tomorrow morning, uh, with clear heads, of course, I'll get here about 9 o'clock, the production team likewise, uh, and the boys will roll in at about 11, and then 12 o'clock, that red light goes, and bang, we're on the air, keeping you right up to date with every time Partner will score against Boreham Wood. <laughs> <laughs> You definitely hear the boys before you see them. You hear like this noise coming up the corridor and you know that one of them's turned up, usually Charlie shouting. Morning, Michael. Oh, Morning, Michael. Morning, Michael. Morning, Morning, yeah. Yeah. Morning gents. Morning. I want this man, this man, want this man on camera and show it. Is he jibbing at that? We don't want to have two of you then. He's just jibbing at that. You know what? What you see on the telly is exactly what they're like. There's no, they're not fake. They're just normal blokes. Morning. Good. Yeah, not bad, you? Yeah, good, thanks. Be all right. Morning. I walk up the stairs because I'm fit. <laughs> 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 just showing up in front of the camera, isn't it? You've got to show that way. This is with the guys' predictions going into Saturday. I think Charlie's been quite successful recently. Um, but he's gone for four 1-1 one, one draws this week, so it's quite interesting. Give me those stats. There he is. Okay. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> These are the predictions. Four 1-1s one, for Charlie this week. Charlie? He's been doing a lot of draws yeah, recently. Look, everybody, oh, they're all sort of polite, you see. They've all gone <laughs> Tottenham Cardiff, they've all gone 2-0s and 3-0s. You know? I've got to go for it, but I thought Absolutely. I was being generous. Yeah, 4-0, four four nil, nil, there you go. You know? There so, you go, perfect. <laughs> Who's got Wigan? Tomo. Tomo's going Wigan. Seriously. I told you. No, he's not kidding you. He actually I told asked, you. He said, Charlie, will you wait until Kaz has left the room? They before got you. Point Kaz, I'm just going to write Wigan. I'm waiting for you to go over there. <laughs> so, I have. Nice caught in camera. You can't get away from it. Seriously, you're doing well. You're 3 2 up against 10 men and nearly lose with a minute to go. I mean, that ain't bad. Yeah, but we were 2 1 down. What have you got for? He's gone for Wigan. Wigan? To beat Preston. It's a derby, isn't it? Isn't it a derby? Well, I guess so. Derby? What, have 200 miles? <laughs> so far, Burnley, Wigan and... Burnley? Come on, we want to see this. Oh, no, I ain't got ready, is it? This. For me to tell someone... This is Mercy's entrance. I walked up the stairs and I'm fit. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you, if I got all six right, I think I'd be sick. I think I'd physically be sick on the show. That's my money, Merce, remember, as well. Yeah, I know, but I won't win. What's that, would I? I can't win. Unless, do I give it all to charity? I don't mind that. Or don't I get, don't we get anything, full stop? Oh, so I would, I, 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 you know, I can tell you now, this is breaking news, I will be physically sick. Well, someone gets it. About the tunnel at the San Siro. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Got a good idea there. 
Lost two, two, lost two nil. It could have been a hundred. That with Maldini marks. Yeah, could have been a hundred. Super Cup final. Super Cup. I just saying to the lad, it's like walking out in San Siro in the tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> San Siro. San Siro. You remember the long tunnel? Have you played it? No. Yeah, no. massive long tunnel. And then you walk up the steps there. Come on, come on. You finished. Got to finish this. You got to go. You're not wrong. Yeah. How you doing? All right. We're, we're early. Twenty minutes to go. Uh, a couple of chairs over there for you. The white ones there, boy. Oh, Phones on silent. Yeah. Phones on silent is really important. Yes. So I can hear mine going. The only one, the only one that's not allowed. <laughs> <laughs> the only one whose phone goes off during live transmission is the presenter. I've got um, my phone rang at about it's probably about two years ago now, and it rang at about quarter to three in the afternoon, and I thought I'll answer it, so I answered it live on air. <laughs> and who who was it? It was Sky, and it was like the commercial department trying to sell me something. <laughs> Do you want? <laughs> Unbelievable. Yeah, Don't give it to. It was shaking. Oh, great. Morning to the 20. What? Morning to the 20. Huh? And how about this for a Royal Rumble in the Soccer Saturday Studio? Royal Rumble! With his guests. Soccer Saturday up next. That. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. B roll. Getting us underway, that was Brotherhood of Man's greatest hits. All of them. Uh, um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're here today, the usual gang, Matt Letizia, uh, Paul Merson, Phil Thompson and Charlie Nick. Yeah, and Gary Neville last night claimed there's something rotten to the core at Old Trafford. This has not been the start of the season the special one had envisaged. So, what's gone wrong? Oh! Back with first action of these three o'clockers in a couple of minutes. This is the way we like it. Super! Come on, Come on give me a decent game today, will you? Been outstanding, started really well, had a free kick, passed the ball around, probing, no shots, but started the better team, bar the, the mistake there, but still nil-nil. Wonderful, goal. Goal ball. On the left, he jinks, he jinks, he leaves, leaves the ball back on toast and just chips it to the far post. Pretty open to begin with, and it's not cold yet. We're from the northeast. Surprised we've got a jacket on, can he? Hopefully, you have seen Hunter Tree at its cutting best today. Yeah. I think you must have witnessed that, Charles. Are you your agreement there? He's not even watching his game. You notice nobody's come to me for my game. You know, they think it must you think it's a person? No. It's a very good game, Charlie. I'm sat in the gallery watching the um, like condo and. Um, it's supposed to be fascinating in there, isn't it? In the gallery. It's unbelievable. All the screens it's and the goals going coming. in and how it depicts it all together, which game to go to at any given time. Oh, it's amazing. Right. Jeff, Jeff is an unbelievable job as well because he can shh, 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 shh. Yeah, no, it's, it's quite an easy job where he's got to We do. make it look it's so easy for yeah, him, you see. It's, Jeff's got the easy part of it. Such a pro. Right, Beck, let's see, you didn't even notice, Charles. Are you, are you doing the second half of this match? No, no, you no not I'm not doing it. No. I can tell what's going on. The other accounts are they're going to cancel the game at 60 minutes. It's going to be one. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Have a good one, guys. January 2017. What a head of time in the bottom corner! He's got two this afternoon, 26 and 16 in his last test. Ball's come back out to him, he whips it in right footed. Spurs show. Spurs. This is 
unbelievable Jeff. Ooh, so go to so my first. Palace in about 15 seconds. 19, Jeff, 19. Got five and five. Penalty at Sheffield It's it. Uh, it's um. Sorry, sorry. Stop. Oh my goodness. Stop. Oh no. That's great. That is scary. Two oh, nil. No, Super six update, Jeff. No jackpot winner. Your money's safe. Uh, let's talk about Super 6. Uh, don't have a jackpot winner. Sorry about that. But well done to uh, Dougie Holroyd from St. Helens. 27 points after predicting five correct scores and one correct result. You get the £5,000 weekly prize. I must know uh, an added bonus for that. You have to get an added bonus. I'm happy. It's horses won. Dougie, Dougie, Dougie. Extra £1,000 is on its way. Extra shout out, Jeff. Six six thousand pounds. <laughs> and by the way, Dougie, you got one wrong. My thanks to Charlie, Cheers, Tomo, Merce, Cheers, and Matt Letitia. Cheers, Cheers, we'll see you in a fortnight's time. Bye bye now. See you again, Tara. I'll ring you, Charlie. <laughs> thanks, guys. Well done. Yeah. Can't watch it. Thanks, guys. Right. Good. Show done. Yes. <laughs> See you later. See you guys. Bye. Thanks. I'll tell you.